Hey everyone, welcome to Tips and Tricks. This is Viren here, and here's yet yet another how-to. So uh, the reason for this video is uh, last week or so I got myself a new Moto uh, 360 second gen smartwatch, and uh, it is being called as an Android Wear. However, it can be paired with an iPhone or Apple devices, and I use an i6. So uh, you know I thought of sharing uh, with everybody as to how. Uh, this Moto smartwatch which is called an Android Wear uh, how it can be paired with uh, Apple devices or an iPhone all right let's get started all right and let's first understand how does this smartwatch talk to the other devices whether it's Android or iPhone well it pairs via Bluetooth uh, to these devices and you also need an app called called as Android Wear on the devices whether it's an Android phone or uh, it's an iPhone now I was looking for this Android Wear on App Store since I'm using an i6 however it was not available uh, it's easily available on Play Store so let me just show you how to actually get this Android Wear on an iPhone or an iOS device uh, if they've made changes and if it's available well and good but if it's still not available on iOS uh, App Store let me just show you how to get it so let me just bring up my phone quickly there you go so <laughs> I'll go to App Store and I'll search for Android Wear oops what happened to the language here okay Android Wear now uh, it's showing up here I'm not sure maybe because I downloaded and then uh, uninstalled it but it's still showing up here but if it doesn't show here let me just show you how to get it. You need to go to your browser and type Android Wear download. You also have a different URL. Uh, you know, I, I'll provide you that URL. Once you do that, the very first option says Android Wear and you can install it. The moment you hit install, it automatically opens up in your app store and you start downloading it. Okay. Once this app is uh, downloaded on your phone, what you need to do is ensure that the Bluetooth is on on the phone, it's enabled, and you need to go into this app Still doing something okay I'll hit that app it'll open up so this is how the app looks like and you see that option which says have a watch let's get you set up if I hit that blue uh, at that white arrow mark in the blue circle it's basically asking do you have a watch to start so you need to ensure that the watch is turned on um, you will get a uh, few screens on the watch uh, you know, you select the language and you accept the uh, privacy policy of Motorola and then hit this option and once again the Bluetooth should be enabled on, on your phone and then it will start looking uh, for the watch now, now let me show you the actual video on your phone you need to tap this and hit the option which says pair with a new variable once you get here, I'll hit this next button. Okay, there you go. It has recognized my watch with EB70. It says connect to your watch. I will say yes. I will hit that code. And the moment you do that, I've got a code on my watch 065582. I'm gonna punch that here. And hit pair. Okay, I'm going to retry again. Five zero six five three four. If you can, as you can see here, it's paired now. So my 
Moto smartwatch is now paired with my iPhone. Still connecting and uh, updating a lot of things. So I guess it's taking out my calendar information. All right, my watch is all nicely paired up with the iPhone, and I'm going to show you one of the one one of the cool things that this app or the smartwatch can do. Uh, so I'm on the Android Wear app on the iPhone. I'll go to Watch Faces. Let me just select one of the dials and see what happens. There you go. Awesome. Let's just try another. There you go. It changes to yellow. So there are a lot of other things it, it can do and I will be coming up with those videos later on. Uh, as for now, I would say thank you for being with me. Thanks for staying. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys.